All right, in this video, we're going to cover how to center an element on a web page with CSS. And we have here on the left side, we have a running web server that's displaying instantaneously the changes that we're going to be making on the right side. So we just have a very simple HTML file and a CSS file. So as I make changes on the right side, it should reflect on the left side which it's not. Let me restart that web server. Okay, here we go. All right, so let me just take care of that one. Okay, so first thing we're going to do is we're going to create a class on that div element. Let's call it center me. And then we're going to create a, uh, an entry in the CSS file like this. Then the first thing we're going to do is we're going to make the position absolute. So that way, if it's going to be inside of another container, it's going to be centered within that container. So right now it happens to be inside the main um, inside like the main body so it's good centered on the entire page but it could just be centered on any one container so like this position absolute we're then going to make it 50 percent from the top and 50 percent from the left okay There. Okay, so now it's for some reason it wasn't updating it instantaneously. Okay, so now we think we're done, but we're actually not done yet because if we look, we're 50% from the top and 50% from the left. If we look here, it's not actually centered because what happens, it, it's the left side. It's that beginning of that H that's 50% from the left and the top of that H that's 50% from the top. So it's actually not really centered. So we want to center the entire thing. We actually want to center it from the middle of this text. And the way to do that is to use the transform, uh, the transform property. And the way we're going to do that is we're going to say transform and then we're going to use the translate function like this where we're gonna we're gonna basically move it back by 50% in, in the X axis and then another 50% on the Y axis like this and then if we see if we play with this as I'm changing it let's say to 10% I could change it to 100%, but I'm going to actually just change it to 50%. So that actually centers it completely on the page. So if we now go back to our page and if we readjust, now the text stays centered.